From the beginning of creation, God made them male and female. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. Just so you all can get a taste of what a day in the life of Pimri consists of, 5 a.m. wake up call, hot yoga at 5.30, get home, get ready for work, heat up the prepared breakfast that was prepared on Sunday with all of her other meals for the week, study a little bit, get to work at 8.30, work until 12, run a few miles at lunch, go back to work, eat her prepared meal at her desk, work till five and study from five to 5.45 before her class at six. Go home at nine, study a little, and then go to sleep to do it all over again the next day. That's the thing I admire about you the most, Peter Marie, your dedication to life and sucking every little thing you can out of it. There isn't an aspect of your life you aren't dedicated to. You have been the best role model to me and kept me on the right path all of these years. So Lindsay introduced us um, at Fuzzies at OU my junior year. It was Isaiah's senior year of college and I was not into Isaiah at all. <laughs> and I don't think he had a crush on me or there was no, we were just friends. After his senior year, he moved to Fort Worth and he got a full-time job at XTO and I was an intern and we were just friends and we used to go to lunch together sometimes. We came home one weekend <laughs> to watch Mio play tennis and he stayed for a women's tennis match for four hours <laughs> and then went to dinner with my family and then he kind of just fit in with my family and then we've been dating ever since. He wrote, Peter Marie is the most kind and genuine spirit I have ever met. Her strengths counterbalance my weaknesses. At the end of most days, it's like a new side of her emerges and I fall in love with her all over again, but for an entirely new and different reason than before. My favorite qualities are that he is extremely generous and he calms me down because that sometimes I can get extremely flustered and anxious and he is really funny and I'm a super planny person and he is not at all. He tries to make sure that everything's perfect for me even though I'm not like that. And he also too is an extremely religious guy and that means a lot to me too. Isaiah has an uncanny ability to make new connections, establishing long-lasting relationships. He can see a vision and make it a reality, all while making life look like a big party. And I wasn't fully aware of this person, of the person who he truly was until he met Peter Marie. Love is a partnership of two unique people who bring out the best in each other, and who know that even though they are wonderful as individuals, they are even better together. And I am proud to say my brother has found that person. You look fabulous. You got some tissues. I just told her to bring him just in case. You're tearing up now. Stop, Dad, you can't make me cry. <laughs> Wait till we get to the church. Dear Heavenly Father, please give Isaiah and Peter Marie their greatest life ever. Take care of them through ups and downs. And Lord, I pray that you would just uh, get them started off right and that you would keep them on your path. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. When I look back since our first ice cream date, you have tried to make each moment with me the perfect moment. Finally, I hope you do not forget what today is all about. We are becoming one in Christ Jesus and our family and best friends are coming here today to be witnesses to our beautiful marriage. I know you are going to be the best loving and supporting husband and the most loving and greatest dad to our future children. I love you so much. See you at 7 p.m.
I, Isaiah, take you, Peter Marie. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Peter Marie, take you, Isaiah. I, Peter Marie, take you, Isaiah. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Isaiah, take this ring. Isaiah, take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Here we stand. The world Firstly, on behalf of myself, Irene, Lance, and April, we thank everyone for coming tonight to, to celebrate this fantastic journey that these two are about to embark on and we're very proud of both of them as you and so we we thank you to for joining us tonight it's your constant love that gives me You are everything I have prayed for my sister to find as her life partner. You are kind, sweet, caring, humble, extremely funny, and you value your family and friends and would do anything to make them happy. You relax her when she is her most stressed self, and you always find a way to let her know you care. Isaiah, I have just a few tips for you now that you are married to my sister. The first one is only buy organic, non-GMO paleo products unplugging every appliance, making sure all of the lights are turned off, no water is running before you leave the house, blowing out all of the candles that have not been lit in about a year, and making sure the door is really and truly locked about nine times. push you to the best of your ability, love you unconditionally, and be a constant support in everything you do. I love you, Peter Marie, with all of my heart. Thank you for being the greatest big sister. I love you, Isaiah. Now take care of my sister for me. She's all yours. To my beautiful bride, I just can't wait to begin. There's an open road for us, and I can't wait to begin. And only God knows how long it is and what obstacles will be in that road. But I, I cannot wait to start the adventure with you. I love you so much, and I can't wait to begin our lives together. It is now my great pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Isaiah Pope. You may now kiss. May God, the Almighty Father, give you his joy and bless you. May the only Son of God have mercy on you and help you in good times and in bad. May the Holy Spirit of God always fill your hearts with his love. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.